In our health cast today, an estimated 10 to 20 percent of breast cancers are known to be triple negative, meaning they don't respond to hormonal therapies as well as other medications. And while this can make triple negative breast cancer more deadly, Dr. Thomas Samuel with the Cleveland Clinic Weston says a recent study found subtypes of this disease that respond differently to the treatment. What it, it tells us is that if you have some of these certain subtypes, they may need less therapy than we normally would recommend. In other words, all triple negative breast cancers are not the same and they shouldn't all be treated the same. You really need a very, uh, uh, you know, expert sort of breakdown on the type of um, triple negative breast cancer is and then tailor the treatment according to that diagnosis. So Dr. Samuel believes research needs to focus on molecular and genetic testing instead to find more treatment options for these subtypes of triple negative breast cancer going forward. And data from a prospective study continues to show that patients with certain blood cancers have a low response to COVID vaccines. The latest prospective study found that fewer than 40% of patients with chronic lymphocytic leukemia, or CLL, had an adequate antibody response after the second dose of the vaccine. Now, other studies have shown a low response rate for people who have multiple myeloma as well. But despite the findings, researchers say patients should still get vaccinated to achieve some level, any level of protection against the virus and continue to follow precautionary guidelines, of course, as well.